Hey y'all, thank you so very much for taking time to come over and visit with me. I'm Ron Fritz cooking again. I'm Fritz, and guys, it's Sunday. So I reckon y'all know what time it is. Time for another Sunday cook, my friends. And last week, guys, I had you, I, I took you along for the ride over at the Lucky's Market. And they had ribeyes over there on sale. Some of the most beautiful ribeyes, best tasting ribeyes I've ever had in a long time. And what we did was we took them out there to the Char Griller 50-50 and we smoked them up a bit. And then we did, uh, I did my first reverse sear. And, and I think it turned out pretty daggone good. But while I was in there, man, the Lucky's Market has such a fantastic meat selection. Not only the ribeyes, but uh, I actually picked up some, uh, some breakfast sausage, some uh, country sausage, and uh, made in-house. And I picked up some of their bacon that it was actually made in house. And I seen all these bratwurst they had. I wish I could have, my camera, I was using my phone and I wish I could have got some better shots for you. Maybe next time I go over there, I will because they're getting ready to have another sale and guess where I'm going. But uh, anyway, guys, what I seen that draw my eye was this pork cherry bratwurst links, guys. So I went ahead and I picked up a couple of them and I just wanted to try them out. And basically they're in, they're artisan, I guess is the way you would explain it. They're made in house. So what we're going to do is we're going to take them out back there on the char griller 50, 50. I'm merely going to gas grill them. And uh, along with it, we're going to have uh, some uh, Walmart uh, mustard tater salad, some coleslaw. We might even top it with a little bit of crispy sauerkraut, put a little bit of celery seed on there. And we're just using some of these uh, cheap old bunny hot dog buns with a little bit of mustard. So I'm hoping y'all will enjoy. Like I said, it's just gonna be a simple cook out there on the Char Griller 5050, and I'm looking forward to it. Thank you so very much, guys. We'll get right back with you. Sorry. Do you want some cherry brats? Is that what you were hunkering for? All right, guys, let's get the Char Griller fired up. All right, got my little grill grates in there. We are good to go. All right, let's let this thing get heat up. All right, guys, our char griller fitty fitty is coming up to temp. Take a peek at them dudes. You can see like little pieces of cherry in there. Ain't that something? Yum, diddly yum. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get started here. Like I said, I've got my grill liners in. Love them things. All right, guys, I believe we are getting there. Mm -hmm. a little blowout in the back one. That's all right. We can deal with that. Get on there. There. Bear with me. All right, guys, I went ahead and I moved them up top. But uh, I'm getting ready to pull these bad boys in just about two minutes. Mm -mm. All right, guys, these bad boys are done. I want me a cherry brat. I want me a cherry brat. Look at them. Mm -mm. That's going to be next level yummy. Here's one with a little blowout. Still looks good to me. All right, guys. Let's head on in. All right, guys. We are ready to eat. We've got our cherry, uh, our bratwurst, our pork cherry bratwurst done up. I think they turned out pretty daggone good. Got our little uh, uh, sauerkraut there. I put a little bit of celery seed up on it. We got our tater salad, our coleslaw, some buns, some mustard, and... Mama puts our Fritos in these Pringles uh, cans, and I think it keeps them fresh. But uh, all right, guys, let me get plated up, and we're gonna get you a shot. We're gonna get right back with you.
It tastes like a brat to me. Mmm. It's actually pretty dang on good. Yeah, it's really good. I didn't think he was going to like it. Mmm. It's really good with the sauerkraut and a little bit of celery seed on it. Mmm. A little bit of my tater salad. Mm-mm. The Walmart has pretty good tater salad and slaw to me. Yeah, they do. Mm. A little Frito. Frito Bandito. Mm-mm. Sorry, just standing awful close here. Mm. Pretty daggone good, guys. Well, guys, I just wanted to say yet again, thank you so very, very much for stopping by and visiting with me over on my, my Sunday cook. It means the world to me. I appreciate you stopping in to see me, Mom, and old Sarge, and I reckon we're going to holler at y'all next Sunday. Thank you so very, very much. We'll talk to you then. Bye-bye.